Oh boy, this is taking a lot longer than I thought it would. Can you guys run up ahead and set up the picnic? Sure. Oh, where are they going with the food? I'm starving. I only had one breakfast. Hey, okay, relax. Look, what was going on back there? Why all the sniping? Not exactly sure. The only one I know is Michael, and we're not exactly best friends. Mm. I'm hungry. Okay, well, don't be such a baby. I cooked you some bacon for a trail snack. I ate it already. What? I could smell it in your purse before I even parked my car. And now it's gone, and I hate everything. I'm sorry about Andy, but I'm not sorry about what I did. What's my crime? I got bold? And a little negligent? Nope! My office, now! Hey, can I smoke in here? You don't smoke. Just asking if I can. Are you high? I'm high on Kaboom. Don't ask for permission, ask for forgiveness. That's right, you never did ask me for permission, did you? Well, I'm sorry to burst your kabubble, but I just had my ass handed to me by the city manager, and now this entire department is screwed. Ron, I'm so, so, so sorry. What the k were you thinking? I would prefer that she ask me for my permission so I can say no. I like saying no. It lowers their enthusiasm. I got a second box of donuts, if anybody. What the f is this? This, Mr. Director, is your new desk. Okay. This desk is the epitome of the Swedish concept of a jämställdakt, or equality. Imagine someone needs your attention. Somebody say my name. Chris. Swivel! What is it, Jerry? You told me to say your name. And you did a great job, superstar. Someone else say something. You look like a freak. Swivel! April, that is not a very good attitude. I will keep my eye on you from my circular desk where I can see everything. Tiny swivel. See how it works? What about my office and its many walls? That becomes a new public waiting room. And we got rid of that giant pillar that was in front of your door. I loved that pillar. It made it really annoying to stand in my doorway. <laughs> well, get over it, because it's gone. You're going to be more accessible than ever. Wow. This is exactly what I imagined heaven looks like right down to the unisex linen tunics. Annabelle, mon chéri. Hi, I'm sorry, I'm late for our coven. I was polishing my oyster forks with a cage-free olive oil rub. Apology accepted, and then I have no reaction to anything else you said. I can't help but ask, but what's in right now? Well, this season, I'm intrigued by asymmetrical overalls, angora toothbrushes, and locally sourced Italian flip-flops. Also, there's a flirty trend in beverages. So you've had soy milk and almond milk. Now, try the hottest new craze, beef milk. It's like almond milk that's been squeezed through tiny holes in living cows. <laughs> milk. Excuse me. There's a sign at Rampsit Park that says, do not drink the sprinkler water. So I made some tea with it, and now I have an infection. Sir? Sir, are, 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 are you listening to me, sir? Sir, I'm talking to you! Sir, sir, are you aware that there is waste in your water system? Okay, Eagleton Ron, tell me a little about yourself. Well, I love the outdoors, love nature. Amen. I'm a big believer in environmental conservation, recycling and composting and the like. I'm a yoga nut. And I'm a nut nut. <laughs> they make delicious milks, man. And I'm a vegan, of course. Slowly working towards full freegan vegan. Hmm. What in God's name is freegan vegan? You only eat vegetables that have been thrown out in people's dumpsters. What is on your foot, sir? My trusty sandals. I believe a man's feet should remain uncaged. Same goes for all chickens. Well, uh, Eagleton Ron, we here in Pawnee value loyalty above all else. So would you be opposed to signing an official loyalty pledge to our new town? Well, as long as that new town were open to the ideals of communal living, where everyone pitches in towards a common good, in the immortal words of Cat Stevens, if you want to be free, be free. I no longer like Ron. I ask you, is this too revealing for a public pool? Kindly get your groin off my desk. So my body makes you uncomfortable too. 
take in the vibe of the room and remain open of mind and of spirit. Now quietly, sit behind me and let's join breath. I'll stand. Interesting technique. All told, we were in there about six hours. And no, I was not meditating. I just stood there quietly breathing. There were no thoughts in my head whatsoever. My mind was blank. I don't know what the hell these other crackpots are doing. Look, a clock. We don't have that in America. You call that a tower? Try the Sears Tower, friend. Nutrium's energy bars are just absolutely loaded with high fructose corn syrup and fatty oils. And any way you slice it, they're just extremely unhealthy for you. Leslie needs to butt out. The whole point of this country is if you want to eat garbage, balloon up to 600 pounds, and die of a heart attack at 43, you can. You are free to do so. To me, that's beautiful. OK, all public photos of me recovered, nameplate removed from my office door, pediatrician files confiscated and destroyed. Anything I'm missing? Great news, Ron. John Ralphio loves your shirt. What the hell are you talking about? Oh, I've been taking pictures of you all day for my new Facebook album, Ron Swan, Getting Off the Grid. Tom, do you maybe see a problem with what you've done? I do now, yes. Sorry. Erase. 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 Erase all pictures of Ron! Erase all pictures of Ron! Erase all pictures of Ron! What the hell is happening? He accidentally opened a vine. You just vined your first selfie, Ron. And I'm vining you vine your selfie. The world is a nightmare. <laughs> hey, Ann, if you get this, I don't know if you should come up here. He's not worth it, okay? Just call me, let me know where you are, and if you have... Ah! Ron? What in the devil's name is this? Portobello mushrooms. Where's the steak? Oh, there's no steak. That's a healthier option. It's organically grown. Go. Oh. Huh? you okay? Whoa, 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 okay. Can you get us a cold compress or something? April! Listen, I was trying to buy this handcrafted mahogany wood model of a B-25 Mitchell Panchito aircraft. Aw, for me? Don't sass me. And I went to this website, and this ad popped up that said, Hey, Ron Swanson, check out this great offer. What's your question? My question is, what the hell? Like, how do they know who you are? Yeah. OK. Um, there are these things called cookies where like, if you go to a site and buy something, it'll remember you and then create ads for other stuff you might want to buy. So it learns information about me? Seems like an invasion of privacy. Dude, if you think that's bad, go to Google Earth and type in your address. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. 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 Oh Are you in a lot of pain? I was shot in the head with a shotgun. Hey, Ron, it's actually not that serious. I just need you to stay calm, OK? Yeah, I'm, I'm just going to stay angry. I find that relaxes me. OK, Ron, we called 911, and they're going to send a ranger. Oh, damn. This is a mess. The rangers won't let us come back next year. You know what? We're not going to think about that right now. You guys, can you just put him on the day bed in the carcass uh, room? Day bed? Yeah. Oh, sure. OK, hold on. Donna? Oh, 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 Donna? Oh, Donna? Are you okay? What is it? Your heart? Are you having trouble breathing? Okay, here's your scotch. Okay, Jerry. Jerry's here. Here's your scotch, Ron. Here we go, Ron. Okay. Hey, you know what is great? Anne's gonna take care of you. And Anne is the best nurse in North America. All right, here we go. Uh, uh, what, you okay? Did you, did you shoot me? What? No. There was a bird kind of near me, and I know how desperate you were to prove yourself. No, no, I swear I didn't. Ron, I swear to God, I've never shot anyone. Well, you better find out who it was, and then purchase them a coffin, because I'm gonna rip them apart. Okay. <laughs>